Hi everyone, this is my one and a half year update on my white common projects at Kelly's Low sneakers. Um, so let's get right into it. Uh, as you can probably tell, I wear these sneakers a lot and they're pretty beat up. Um, I don't really believe in babying shoes like some people do. Um, I do take good care of them. I usually uh, store them with uh, cedar shoe trees. Right now I'm just using cheap Ikea ones. Um, Really, the shoes are in pretty good condition. There's some some scuffing on the toe here and just overall dirty dirtiness, which I'm going to clean off later in the video. Um, some scratches here and some creasing in the leather, particularly around the heel area and also around the toe, which is kind of normal. Very worn in look. Um, kind of like that. Uh, a little more damage on this one see right here below the gold numbers we've got some cracking in the leather so it'll focus um, this one also has more heel drag on the right here compared to this one but overall pretty good condition considering I've worn them basically every day uh, for the past few summers and then on and off in the fall and spring as the weather permits some creasing on here, also more scuffing on the toe and the little tabs right here. Probably gonna replace the laces soon, they're starting to yellow and I haven't been able to um, get them back to a true white, so I'll probably put in the spare uh, pair of laces. Uh, for anyone who is wondering about sizing on these or looking to buy them, I wear a US 10 in most shoes. So 10 in Nikes, 9 in Converse, and these are 42s. And they started a little bit tight, but after a few months they stretched out really nicely and now they're my best fitting pair of shoes for sure. Um, so I bought them back in probably f January, February of 2016. And I got them on Grailed from a guy who had worn them once and I guess they didn't fit him or whatever. So I think I paid about $270 or so for them, which is a really good price for the white. You can find oftentimes a lot of the other colors on deep sale. Um, I know right now on some of the sites, I've seen some of the summer pairs for you know, well below $250, even below 200 some of them. But the white ones really don't go on sale very often, so I was pretty lucky to pick these up. Um, and they were in pretty pristine condition when I got them. The only thing was that on the inside here, the Common Project Gold lettering was already kind of worn out and it was a little dark in here. So the guy probably wasn't wearing socks or something when he wore them. But all in all, after um, a year and a half, they're definitely my most uh, favorite pair of summer shoes and definitely my most worn. Um, so I definitely recommend them to anyone who's looking to pick up white sneakers. Um, I had Stan Smiths for a long time, but these, I just wanted them forever and I finally picked them up and I'm really glad I did. Just a really clean, simple, well-built white sneaker. Um, so that's about it for the one and a half year update. Uh, let's get into the cleaning.